Hi guys, this is Linda, and today I'm doing something a little bit different. I'm coming to you face-to-face -to, -face to tell you guys a little bit about what my plans are for my YouTube channel in 2023. So I am going to continue with a lot of the same content that I've been sharing in the past, but I still wanted to check in with you guys and kind of give you an overview of what my plans are for 2023 and what my content will look like moving forward. So I have been busy over on AllieEdwards.com teaching a class called Plan, Prep, and Play. And in that class, I am sharing my entire process from start to finish of project planning, goal setting, and getting my ideas down on paper from a scrapbooking perspective. I've also been sharing some more of my organizational tips and using up your stash over in that classroom. So if you are looking for more of that type of content from me, go check that class out. It is still for sale and I will link it in the description box below. I am going to continue sharing that type of content over here on YouTube. However, I will not share anything quite as comprehensive as that class. Um, in the past, I have shared organizational videos with you and I intend to continue doing that in 2023. I still have a few areas of my craft room that need organization and I'm hoping to get to those and share some of those with you um, sometime this year. I also am hoping to share a little bit more of the rest of my house with you. I recently bought or built a house in 2020 and I am working on the process of decorating and organizing my entire home. And a lot of the concepts that I use in my craft room organization apply in the rest of my home as well. And some of those are DIY projects and um, similar type things that I hope to share with you in the year ahead. I of course am going to continue Project Life. I still need to finish my 2022 albums and intend to share most of those spreads with you. Some of them are going to be exclusive content in the Plan, Prep, and Play classroom. And then in 2023, I am going to be sharing process videos just like I have in the past. Um, this year, I am switching things up a little bit and I am going to be working in a 9 by 12 size rather than a 12 by 12 size. I am setting that album up in the Plan, plan Prep, and Play classroom and sharing the first few spreads in there, but I will continue sharing the rest of the process videos for the year over here on my YouTube channel. As far as December daily content, so I was fairly successful in sharing with you guys my process videos this past December, and I had a ton of fun doing that. But if you've noticed, I only made it through day 18. And a lot of that had to do with me working behind the scenes on content for my class. I have decided to slow down a little bit on December daily. I am going to finish my album behind the scenes and I will share it with you next fall so that I can share with you those process videos and a complete walkthrough of my album. I also am hoping to finish my 2022 One Little Word album. That's a project I haven't really shared over here, but I have shared flip throughs of prior albums in the past. And once that album is completed, I intend to share it with you here. For 2023, I am going to be working in the folio for One Little Word, and I am hoping to share with you a little bit more about my process as the year progresses. In 2023, I am planning in a Hobonichi. I have shared a little bit about that here on my YouTube channel, and I hope to share some more Hobonichi content with you as the year goes forward. This is a Hobonichi cousin. Um, I do use it as a general planner, I can show you like I do some like checklists and I have my daily planning. I have my goal setting and this is like my life planning is in here. Um, I might do some plan with me. I'm not entirely sure if that is something that I'm really interested in doing, but let me know in the comments down below what you would like to see from me in terms of planning content from my Hobonichi. My craft planner is still in golden coil like I did last year. And I will probably share some craft planning stuff with you at some point this year. A lot of that content is in the plan prep and play classroom, including how I am using my planner this year and how I'm setting my annual goals and my goals for January. Something new this year is I am keeping a Hemlock and Oak daily journal 
in the 2023 daily planner. Um, I am just doing some daily pages in here and I intend to con continue this daily all year long. And I will probably share some flip throughs with you here, maybe like at the end of the month. But please, again, let me know in the comments what you would like to see from me. In addition to those projects, I intend to continue doing story kits and quarterly scrapbook kits. I'm hoping to do a little bit more of the type of video like I shared with you last year with one of the quarterly scrapbook kits where I show you my plan for that kit and then my completed layouts. I don't intend to do process videos for all of those layouts. That is just a lot of content, but I do have an entire kit start to finish in the plan prep and play classroom. So you can go ahead and join that class to see that content over there. In addition to scrapbooking and planning and journals, I also am thinking of branching out a little bit and trying some other crafts. I have always been super crafty, but I haven't really shared a lot of that here with you guys on my YouTube channel. I am partnering with some brands that I will share more information on that going forward once I have more information to share with you and some projects to share with you, but I'm super excited to share some ideas with you in the year ahead. Um, one last thing I did want to say to you guys, thank you so much for being patient with me this January as I have been working on so much stuff behind the scenes with my plan prep and play class that I haven't had a ton of time to create regular content for you here, but I am still very active on Instagram and you can follow me there to see my projects and, and daily stories of what I am up to. I will be back posting here very regularly starting towards the end of the month or into February and then you will get the regular content that you are used to from me which is usually about two videos per week. So I know this was kind of a short video but I just wanted to pop in here say hi put my face on screen and thank you all for being here for supporting my channel and for sticking with me when I'm not super consistent with posting that is something I definitely want to work on in this year and I hope that you will enjoy all of the content that I have planned for you. Please leave comments down below and let me know what type of content you do wanna see from me. In addition from the regular stuff, I do intend to branch out as I discussed in this video and probably some other things. So please just let me know your thoughts. And I look forward to bringing more content to you in 2023. Bye.